In this video, I'll be addressing Fairly Weak Ho. Hello, Fairly Weak. Uh, and I'll be drinking a uh, the most outstandingly delicious barley wine you could possibly imagine. It's, it's yum. Uh, well, <clears throat> Wei, what do you want to talk to me about, Earl? You might say Fairly Weak Ho. Um, well, Fairly Weak, I will explain it to you clearly so you understand where I'm coming from. Barley wine. Uh, fairly weak, you've left some uh, insulting uh, homophobic comments on my page. I, I don't like that. And uh, and then when I was talking to Glitch about this exact same thing, like I, I like it's okay to have tr uh, problems between people, and it's totally okay to fix them. Um, so if you're having a problem with somebody. You're like, hey man, I don't, I don't understand what's going on. Why don't, you, why don't you talk to me about it, and I'll talk to you about it. And we've come to some sort of mutual concession, and uh, and get along. I mean, because I think that like, for the most part, we're a lot, of, we're similar. A lot of us are similar. Um, we've got some dissimilar ways of being, <clears throat> and uh, I think we're all just gonna have to be fine with that, right? You know, because like. If I want to argue with anybody or, or criticize anybody that's just a little bit different than I am, you know, somebody that thinks that uh, St. Patrick can beat up Thor, I'm like, what, you're going to tell me that? You know, I get all crazy about that. St. Patrick can't beat up Thor. Um, but then I just got to say, we're just going to be different. Um, you express yourself one way, I express myself another, but that's no telling that, you know, those two things might actually, in the future, um, help either of us express ourselves better. Um, so that's why you try, that's why I think you try to get along with people. And if you don't, if you, if you say to yourself, if you're like, you're fairly weak ho and you say, and I'm upset at Earl, I'm gonna make a, uh, I'm gonna make a homophobic comment uh, about him and Falstaff. Um, and our, oh, on that glitch video, you called me pompous. Um, but at, at no point in time, fairly weak, have you actually said what your problem is? Um, and, uh, and that's my only problem. It's, uh, like, why in the world would you even, uh, bring it to my notice that you're upset with me if you weren't gonna say, this is what upsets me? Um, yeah, you know, homophobic comments and, uh, you know, saying I've got some sort of, like, what, inf like, pompous like an inflated sense of self or no like a a height uh, an out of proportion sense of uh, of ego um. <laughs> um, yeah um, that's funny actually I like that one um, someone called me trite once too that I quite liked but I mean that's the thing though about like just you know saying insulting uh, things because either I'm going to uh, Either I'm not going to get it, I'm going to go, huh? Or I'm going to think it's like, um, it's indicative that you're upset, but that you don't know how to communicate it in a way that would make me understand why. So, uh, so yeah, that's, uh, that's, that's what I'm trying to tell you. Like, if, if someone's bothering you, if you want to insult somebody, flat out tell them exactly what bothers them, what bothers you about them. That's insulting. So, I better threaten you with an O'Doul's. Alright, Fairly Weeko. If you got a problem with the Earl, say what the problem is. Don't just say silly stuff at me. Actually, just man up, cam up, and say, Earl, this about you bothers me. Or, you know, if you don't want to do that, just, you know, you could write me or something like that. I mean, or you don't have to do anything. You might just say sorry. I was I was drunk and rude, um, but uh, but my point here's where we get to the trite bit. My point is, if somebody's bothering you, just tell them why. You don't have to insult them. Just say why. All right, fairly weak, <laughs> You've been threatened with no duels.